pray from your heart. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're rounding up. We're going to sing this song, God's Ability. Sing it with all your heart and I want to prophesy upon you. Are we together? There is an unction that can come upon you. Can come upon your business. Can come upon your academics. Can come upon your life. You may be gifted, but is your gift anointed? It's one thing to be gifted, but it's another thing for that gift to have an anointing. When little brings much, it is anointed. When much brings much, it is scientific. When much brings little, it is demonic. But when little brings much, it has to be supernatural. God's ability. God's ability. He's working in me. He's working in me. God's That's what you see lifting this ministry. Recession proof, pain proof, stress proof by the unction of the spirit, rising like an edifice as though Satan does not exist. By a mystery, no gate of hell can unravel. But in me, it's God's ability. God's ability is working in me. Hallelujah. I want to pray for you, but I want to speak some blessings upon you. It says, Early will I seek you to see your power and your glory in my life as I have seen in the sanctuary. It's one thing to see the hand of God in a sanctuary. Help her, please. And then it's another thing to see it in your life. It's one thing to see God move in koinonia. But it's another thing to see it work in your life. I want to pray for you. No, no. Something must land in your life. Please. I want you to believe this with all your heart. One of the gifts that God has given us in this ministry is the gift of helpers. We never raise a voice to cry without somebody answering. And it was a light God gave me. It says you will call on man and a nation will answer. I want to pray for you. There is an unction that makes men come to your aid. In the name of Jesus. Right now by the power of the Holy Ghost. In this night of prayer. I release that anointing. All over the building. Inside and outside. Receive that anointing right now. Receive that anointing right now. Receive that unction right now. The unction that draws help us. I tell you, fire is falling on people. The unction from heaven that calls help us to your life. Strange help us. Hallelujah. We're still praying. We're rounding up this prayer session. I want to pray for you. Brothers and sisters, if I tell you I do not know what the favor of God looks like, I will be lying to you. There is such a thing called the Esther anointing. God gave me this revelation in 2010 that there is an anointing called the Esther anointing. The Bible says Esther found favor on everyone who looked at her. It was like a cloth she was wearing. Once you look at them, the mantle comes upon you. You must favor them. Listen, there is such a grace. When men make contact, for as long as their eyes can see you, something must force resources from them. I pray for you. 
in the name of the Lord God of heaven by the mystery of favor I see this falling on people receive the Esther anointing now 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 receive the Esther anointing enough is enough I prophesy it inside outside everywhere online receive the Esther anointing the Esther anointing strange favor strange testimony strange favor I prophesy it let it enter your spirit I activate it let it work in your life strange favor strange favor strange favor strange favor strange favor listen if you want to pay your way through life you will die young it's not about being rich it's about being favored it's not all about money there are some things money cannot do are we together favor we are going to pray for speed speed it's a grace that makes men run and do so much in a short time listen there is a cause of retrogression in many families and many lives it's not that they are stagnated but they are moving too slow when a man buys his first car at 70 years it's not a testimony are we together when our parents at 65 are still looking for money to complete lintel it's a cost many parents are waiting for their children to build for them but the bible says a good man leaves an inheritance for his children's children i want to pray for you there is such a thing as speed there is such a thing as speed some of us are moving god is helping us but if you are to be sincere your pace is slow financially is too slow in every wise ministerially is too slow entrepreneurially is too slow it's too slow are we together a woman can give birth to give birth to three children in 20 years is not a testimony are we together you take in five years after your marriage first child seven years later that's when you can take in again nine years later that's when the third one comes you are now using your pension to pay the secondary school fees of, of children it's a cost are we together the lord must send speed to our lives some of us the the things you plan from january till now not one you have not ticked it one no you need grace there, there is a grace that accelerates men are we together let me share this with you with all humility I went to check my list of the things that I was trusting God would do in my life I found out that certain things that were least for other years God had gone ahead to start doing them and I said Lord you are faithful and the Lord said if you trust me I can surprise you to the end of the year that's what God said and I believe it for us all we're praying we've been trusting God for a place of counseling you know because of the crowds that come and just last week a family I think they are represented here just came and met us and said they wanted to give us their whole church facility to be using for counseling at no charge that's the gift of men are we together the gift of men there's a song in my heart i'm not here about you know the song who knows the song we need to sing that song do you know the song? Send it out a beer. Send it out a beer. See you. See you. Send it out a beer. Send it out a beer. See you. Yeah. 
make arrangements for as many buses even if they have to come back multiple times don't be afraid we're going to make sure if it's possible to transport everybody we'll send you so don't be afraid of time praise the lord it's part of the wicked stupid things that poverty does for people god wants to bless you you are thinking we cause that spirit in the name of jesus focus and concentrate we are blessed enough to take you home don't rob yourself of the miracle are you hearing what i'm saying i want to speak from the depth of my heart you need speed this prayer session is important you need speed in your life some of us you are too slow everything you do is like the spirit of a tortoise you are limping when others are flying the bible says they that wait upon the lord they will renew their strength he said they will mount up with wings as eagles riding through the current i pray for you in the name of jesus christ there is a grace that makes men catch up some of you is not even speed what you need is restoration first before speed are we together hallelujah someone we used to know many years ago we had the opportunity of seeing that person this year and when we saw that person this year it was an apology it was horrible he was looking like a thief after many years do you know it's a terrible thing for you to be growing older and nothing is growing with you the only thing growing in your life is your age it's a cause are we together don't say you are too young to be blessed don't allow the cause that came with your village where the first person to take his head out of the water did it at 40 and they say you are too young too young for what you are not too young for trouble why should you be too too young for blessings when trouble comes people say it's all right but when blessings come they say well, how did this happen i want to pray with, for you let a, a dimension of speed that will make men ask you what are you using i pray for you in the name of jesus christ at the count of three may that function for speed honestly from my heart let it fall on people lord i'm praying at the count of three release grace oh god move your people forward one two three take that grace now take that grace right now help them speed 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 shaparakata speed i command speed where you have been crawling start running start running start running where you have been running start flying start flying by prophecy start flying by prophecy start flying pursue overtake recover without fail i prophesy to you pursue overtake pursue overtake pursue overtake recover Thank you for lifting. 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 In two minutes, I'd like you to thank God expressions of deep gratitude lord i thank you speak to him in your language expressions of deep gratitude thank you jesus i have prayed it my hands will handle it i have prayed it my hands will handle it I have prayed it, my hands will handle it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't worry.
worry whether you are standing or not just a sign of faith i want to pray for you the lord has declared that is this year of triumph let's not make him look like a liar you've heard the testimonies of people hallelujah in the name of jesus christ the sovereign lord the one who orchestrated this message i pray for you prophecy number one is that in the name of jesus the son of the living god beginning from this night a man everybody one by one a man must show up in your destiny a man must show up in your destiny hallelujah prayer point number two paul said once and again i desire to come to you but satan hindered us satan hinders men there are some of you god answered your prayer since last year but there is a spirit somewhere sitting on your breakthrough in the name of jesus I'm, I'm prophesying i'm just speaking in tongues in the name of jesus every force sitting on your gate to make it not open for your helpers i cast those forces out of your life i cast those forces out of your life i cast those forces out of your life listen whether it's an activity of witchcraft an activity of causes projections of men in their anger the scourging tongues of men to cause the constellations to fight you in the name of jesus christ who died and rose again i command your gates open i command your gates open i break the power of divination i break yokes and causes i break the power of divination when jesus got to the grave of lazarus others were crying but they did not know even in the grave if a man comes resurrection can happen the grave was there waiting for a man when jesus came he said ah uh -uh, hold on lazarus only the voice of a man could call another man not the voice of an animal the voice of a man and he said lazarus come for come for come for i want to call some things i want to call some things back they left you but they are not missing they are still on earth they left you but hear me they are not missing in the name of jesus christ i prophesy whatever has left your life whatever has left your hands money that you lost business that you lost relationships opportunities i prophesy restoration now restoration now restoration now listen listen i don't care what happened i i don't want to know the story behind it in the name of jesus christ even if it's a body parts that disappeared i call a new one now whatever is the works of your hands that for some reason you do your best but it's like it cannot break through some levels there are people here who are business people there are people here who are working and they've been in the same position forever there are people who don't just move forward in the name of jesus whatever has tied your feet so that there is no speed in your life 
I command supernatural speed right now. Supernatural speed right now. Supernatural speed right now. Hallelujah. Was he praying? Listen. There are men being influenced by demons to stop the moment the God, the Spirit of God is moving the will of a man to your favor. They show up just like a man shows up. They show up and they impart fear. There are people who would have done your business, but just when they wanted to put money, somebody said, be careful, oh, and they went away. There are people who would have bought your product in box, but someone showed up and said, do you really need it? In the name of Jesus, whoever is stopping men from blessing you, whoever is being used by demon spirits to stop men from blessing you, I silence their voices right now. I silence their voices right now. Every council of Ahitophel speaking in dark places against the people of God, I reverse their pronouncements right now. Hallelujah. Last prayer point. And Jesus grew in stature, in wisdom, in stature, and in favor with God you can have favor with God and not have favor with men I want to speak favor we must attack hardship and do you know listen listen by now you know but do you know why we do these things because we want to concentrate on doing the work of the kingdom these things are distractions thinking about money is a distraction thinking about all these all these jargons you can't pray you spend three hours you are not praying for souls you are praying out of against trouble it's a distraction you can't have the peace to plan your family well because you sit down and there's tension everywhere why because of all kinds of issues in the name of jesus i pray may fresh mantle of favor a mantle of favor a real solid mantle of favor may it land upon your life right now favor with men favor with men receive it in the name of jesus favor with men i place it upon your life favor with men favor with strangers favor with men favor with strangers favor with diplomats favor with men of god favor with politicians favor with business people in the name of jesus listen every time a man is looking for someone to bless may you show up there suddenly in the name of jesus christ anytime they are discussing someone to lift may the angel of the lord introduce your name The angel saluted Mary and said, Hail Mary, thou art favored among all women. And she wondered, what manner of salutation is this? These are the forces that produce certain strange levels of breakthrough. Tomorrow you will turn and see that things are working for you. And people say, how did you do it? You are no more qualified than me. Your father is nobody in the society. And you tell them, I understood that there is something called the gift of men. The gift of men. The gift of men. The gift of men in your life. And it will change your life. Lord Jesus, we thank you for tonight. Lord, I have declared your word to your people. In the name of Jesus, let there be a strange performance. We release angels to compel the men that we have called by prophecy. Because some of them have stubborn wheels, but we compel them by the ministry of angels. And we decree and declare that they must show up for every life, business, destiny, and ministry. In the name of Jesus.
may your life from tonight receive a quantum leap may you have a testimony that will end worry from your life forever and let me just use one minute and extend this prayer to our worrying families because some of our family members they are almost depressed to death the yoke on their head is too much it's as if they are carrying the whole world there are bills here there's trouble here there's court case here there is police case here there is the, nobody to help them lord jesus we pray anyone standing here may you represent your family right now as i pray in the name of jesus christ using you as a prophetic point of contact i pray for your loved ones the same thing god is doing here may he reproduce it to them every impossible situation in any family right now that looks like it defies solution this night may a helper qualified to help arise and help if it's a financial problem may a helper arise to help if it's a marital and family problem may a stranger arise and help in the name of jesus christ if it's a spiritual problem may a man with an anointing appear and